Hello traders, this is Orlando for Tradimo. And uh, well, today we're going to talk about the US dollar and gold. Uh, let's start with the US dollar. Now the US dollar is a very interesting spot because as you remember, we were, when we were talking about where it bottomed around the 95.70 level and the 261.8 uh, projection from the first leg down, we and also was uh, the test of this uh, long-term uh, trend line, we rallied all the way up to the 97 level and then broke with the 97 level and tested it once, twice before moving all the way up to the 97.50 level, which is also the 161.8 uh, projection of the first leg up, right? Now, uh, with the bad data that has come out of the US this week, we had this dip on the US dollar index but buyers were found again here at the 97 level which confirms this base at the 97 level and confirms that there are really heavy buyers at this level now what's interesting about today's price action is that uh, well is this um, very bullish candle this is the four hour chart and as you can see this four hour candle engulfs the last six candles in, in price action all right now this is a very bullish move on the us dollar and as you can see the bullish move continues now this is all uh one day away from this month's non-farm payrolls and as you remember last month non-farm payrolls were a disastrous 20,000 jobs added in february now the uh, the forecast is 175,000 jobs added in March, which will beat uh, by far last month's uh, numbers. And if we beat expectations, we can expect a rally at least to test the 9770 level again, if not fa to finally break it or break above it. Now, this is all very interesting because, as you remember, we are in a short position in gold and have been for a while now. We, I think we have, a, uh, well, we, uh, we are in this position in gold since we broke with this, um, uh, well, this bear flag. Uh, and, and this was uh, last week when we grabbed and we monetized on this move to the point of control. Now that was a great move and we, we actually um, uh, took half of our position here at the point of control or this previous base at around 1292. And price action in gold has been trading inside of this triangle, which is uh, by all means a continuation pattern. Now, with what I just told you about uh, the US dollar or the DXY uh, gaining bullish momentum, we can and will consider a continuation of this bearish move below the point of control to the previous base around the 1278 level now if we go to the daily chart uh, on gold you can see that so let me just thicken this out for you guys well you can see that this is actually a uh, very uh, well it looks like a beautiful continuation um, pattern and uh, the previous base around the 1278 level is going to be a strong support level. Now, if we break with this level, we might test this ascending uh, channels uh, support for maybe a break and a test of the um, 1230 level. Again, this is on the very long term and we continue our short bias in gold below the 1300 level. Now, if uh, you're not a premium member and uh, if you're not in our signals community and our premium uh, technical analysis community, I'm going to leave you a link below this video for you to um, get a one month trial. All right. So you get access for a month uh, to all of our uh, premium services uh, by clicking on the link below this video.